and crucial moment we lose James Pierce but anyway there he is or was in the thick of it in Cape Town right now though let's have a look at the weekend weather with Louise Lear hello Hi there, Sophie. Well, I've got my fingers crossed that the only thing controversial this weekend we'll be discussing is not England's performance, that it's the feel of the weather. Apologies, but feeling cooler, even cooler, if you've been disappointed with the weather so far this week. And the reason for this is we've got this band of cloud that's been descending from the south over the last few hours. It's producing some sharp showers, a beautiful end of the day across Scotland and Northern Ireland here, but already that fresher air digging in. But these sharp showers with a severe weather warning across South Wales and Somerset and Dorset, slowly clearing during the evening and then under those clear skies a chillier night particularly for the Midlands and particularly for areas in sheltered glens of Scotland but generally we're looking at those temperatures into double figures but the talking point will certainly be the feel of things for tomorrow that stiff northerly breeze particularly piling in down along the North Sea coast dragging in more cloud and certainly the potential for more showers now it's a difficult one because the further west you go you'll certainly have lighter winds they'll be noticeable but lighter and with the sunshine high in the sky at this time of year in Delta, 18 degrees in Plymouth won't feel too bad. And the same too for Cardiff, at largely dry with some decent sunny spells around as well. Not a bad afternoon to come as well for Northern Ireland. 17 degrees for you, dry, and again, some decent sunshine. We could get 19 for Glasgow, but just look at Aberdeen. Add on the strength of that wind, a disappointing 13 degrees with a lot of cloud. It's going to feel pretty miserable. And the same too for Newcastle. Now, we pick up the chance of these showers, really from East Yorkshire down into Lincolnshire. East Midlands, East Anglia, the southeast corner as well could pick up one or two showers. So 13 degrees in Norwich with some showers and quite a strong breeze. It's going to feel disappointing for the middle of June. Ending with some good news, though. Fingers crossed on Sunday, slightly lighter breeze, less chance for shower. Things just turning that little bit warmer with highs generally of 19 degrees. So that's how we finish. Fingers crossed it's a positive result for the weather and for England. Back to you, Sophie. <laughs> Thank you very much. A reminder of tonight's main news. Hundreds of parents...